And the emergency boil order continues in Roberts. A truckload of relief arrived today. Eyewitness News 3's Braden Wilson was there for the delivery. Eighteen pallets of water offloaded today to help out Roberts while the boil order remains in effect. The water was trucked in from Salt Lake City, and the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints reached into its reserves to help. Roberts Mayor says getting it out to people is the priority. The next step with our bottled water uh, this afternoon will be uh, getting our volunteers together, uh, figuring out how many cases we can allot to each household, and uh, our, our main uh, plan right now is to have people come to where we've got it stored at our Mustang Center at the city shop, come by, uh, helpers will help load it into their cars, uh, people who are homebound or are unable can contact us. We've got volunteers that have already offered to help deliver. The mayor of Roberts is also the owner of BJ's Bayou Restaurant. Berlin says while the boil order has made some things harder, they are working through it. The restaurants are required by law to have sanitizing systems in place in their, their dish uh, dishware cleaning and washing and glassware washing. So that sanitizing is very strong and it takes care of the, the cleaning of things. Uh, cooking, obviously if you're cooking, you're boiling. Testing continues and the latest round looks promising. Our, our operator came to me while we were unloading this truck to let me know that seven tests that were done yesterday all came clean. The boil order is still in effect, so that's, that hasn't changed. But it's a good sign that we're moving forward. And uh, we're still looking into finding out why we have a problem, how to solve the problem, and how to hopefully never have the problem again. In Roberts, I'm Braden Wilson.